in the world of fragrance, making you smell delicious and offending you at the same time may be considered especially heinous. In New York City, a gorgeous Cubano and his elite squad of ball sprayers will seek out these colognes and investigate them. This is his story. Bitch. This is 4th of July, beautiful peoples. As you can see here, we're doing something external, outdoors, being one with nature. And I just happened to find Paul Bunyan behind me. The size <laughs> of this fucking guy. I had to get the ultra-wide zoom Hold lens up. to get... See, that's some bullshit right there. First of all, <laughs> the disrespect Fucking is midget. inevitable. I'm not midget. I'm 6'5", 250 pounds solid. There's a six-pack under this keg, you piece of shit. Today, we are bringing you a beautiful, fresh fragrance that's a super cheapy and hyped. So I enlisted the help of lesser people in life to help me out and give me their, you know, basic bitch perspective. This guy, one step above Ja, but shout out to Ja for sticking his fucking head always in the lens. Wow! Can we just roll my motherfucking music and get to this shit? Cause the ratchery will start now. You sexy motherfucker. We're all alone. 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 Blessed morning, my beautiful peoples. You know who it is. It's your boy. C to the U to the B to the A. And I have, um... Dolph with me. Most of you true ball sprayers know this gargantuan head from a previous video which was the uh, Super Aventus video and now you get to see him again please he is about six and a half feet back because he's seven foot five foot eight foot twelve but the fragrance we're bringing you today is actually super great super cheap green as fuck and perfect for this weather you know we're trying to stay away from the freshies but this one had to be talked about because anything under fifty dollars is a plus the fragrance that i'm talking to you about is platano Rep <clears throat> banana republic <laughs> vintage green 78 <laughs> shut up what the oh, fuck was shit. <laughs> This fragrance right here is absolutely amazing, especially for about 40 and under. Now, I decided, you know, since I am a fragrance expert, the Yahweh of fragrance, the biggest in the motherfucking game, I would bring upon somebody who's, you know, small, insignificant, doesn't mean shit, to smell this and give me his personal perspective. This is a very amateur, huge nose, but you know, he can smell something. I've already sprayed it on his left arm, so it's dried down, but we're gonna try to get an opening and a dry down perspective from somebody who really doesn't matter, but you know, he's kind of... True story. So Dolph, if you mind if I spray your huge gargantuan 14 inch wrist, and please smell that and let me know what you think. First of all, let's start real basic. Do you like this or do you like, nah? It is appealing, absolutely. Absolutely appealing, I like that. What do you think of it? What do you get right off top once you first smell it? What's the first impression that you get? Sweet, it's citrus. Got some kind of like uh, evergreen forest type of feel to it. I get that, it. facts. Very sweet, definitely. At a, a scale from 1 to 10, the opening, what would you rate it, Sasquatch? I could give it 1 to 10, I'd give it like a 6.7. That's, that's, that's not bad. Would this, would this be something you wear just based on the opening, though? Oh, yeah, I could fuck with this on a daily. Casual? Yeah, Chill? absolutely. Would you wear this like on a dressy occasion? You don't go to no dressy occasion. That was like a, no, that was a kind of trick question. Stop driving. Still that was a trick question. You don't, you don't dress up. They don't make clothes that big. So what I'm gonna give you my perspective is this is an amazing green, wet, slightly floral as you mentioned, amazing bergamot. And one of the notes in here that's actually my favorite is fig. I fucking love fig. Fig and plum kind of around the same family, so I kind of fuck with it. Beautiful fig, sweet, citrus, bright, airy. Uh, for oh, under 50... It's fucking crazy, you're getting out of control. Sorry. Longevity was really solid. Siage is not crazy above average on my skin. I think it's super pleasant. It's nothing like green Irish tweed, but it still has that same green aspect to it. Dolph, your huge left hoof has it dried down. How does it smell dried down? Has it changed or does it smell very similar to the opening? Speak. Fucking hunchback of Notre Dame. <laughs> Sweetness is not as as potent as, okay. it, as it was. All right. Don't be using big words, you know, you don't know nothing. Citrus is still hanging in there. Yeah. You and still get green? 
Do you smell any fig? Do you know what smigs, uh, fig smell like? Smigs, yeah, smigs. A little bit, I mean. You get mostly green citrus. Yeah, yeah just a, a fraction. Yeah, exactly what this is, vintage Something that green. you're not gonna pick up unless you know what you're smelling, which. Banana Republic Vintage Green. He gave it a six point, hmm? Seven. All right, cool. Let's stick the length of my... I, I give this a solid 7.5 in my Cuba meter. I think this is absolutely awesome, especially for the price. For you, those of y'all who have tired vintage green, let me know what the fuck y'all think. I think it's dope. Is this a ball sprayer? Yeah, Dolph, spray the nuts. A little lower. Get it right on the, right on the cuff. Mm, mm. My balls are smelling vintagey green already. They're like black and white balls right now. That's how vintage this motherfucker is. Speaking of black and white, you know the cookie factory went out of business, right? What? <laughs> I love y'all motherfuckers. Black and white cookie. Shit went out of business in Manhattan. Goodbye. I Fuck love you. I love y'all motherfuckers from the heart and these confused testicles. I'll see y'all bitches next time. You know who it is. He might eat me. It's your boy. Yo, Ja. Yo, my man, $50, bitch. See? It's not me who owes it. Now it's Ja. Smooches. Who's best? One of them's gonna pass the test. Who's best? For the fly gun holder, money folder, roller, star tag when it's time to call back. For the rough rugger that raw way, this nigga Jay, it's a game, but he don't play. Hey. For all the chicks that got dead in the penthouse suite on top of my mom's crib. Hey. It's long since you never get in. It's long since you would think that you would. <laughs>